My name is uh, Cheryl Piner. I'm a pilot here at uh, Air Zermatt. It's a company in the Swiss Alps. Well, you know, it started 55 years ago when uh, the former pilots, uh, they were confronted in different uh, and difficult situations and they had to find solutions. And out of these solutions, we found uh, very good new techniques are adapted uh, in most of the high alpine uh, rescue organizations so far. And then, of course, we tried to give this experience, this knowledge uh, further to our young pilots. And when uh, VR Motion, Loft, came up with uh, this new technology, this new simulator H125, we were super happy to test it out and we were amazed by the performance. The advantage of the VR goggles are simply, it's, it's, a, it's a game changer. You know, we used to have these big domes, these cockpits, where the re resolution was not good. Everything below 30 knots was unreal. So you had to learn to fly the simulator. So with the Vario headset, we have a tool which is so realistic, and that's what the pilot needs, especially for the helicopter flight where you're most of the time below 30 knots operating a helicopter and uh, to use this uh, uh, technique it's a big big asset for us. The combination of this Vario headset together with this avatar uh, design and the cockpit where you can use all the switches and it, it, that combination makes it the best simulator I've ever flown. The next advantage this new technology uh, brings along is that you can do all the exercises related to an LPC or to an OPC below 30 knots. And this is a big safety issue. This is a gain in, in uh, safety. And of course also uh, you have less risk of a damage. There were so many emergency procedures we could not exercise on the real aircraft without having a high risk of damaging something and this tool uh, is preventing that so it's a big big gain in safety. Next step is you can use this device day and night so you are not um, related to the weather forecast, to the program uh, that the helicopter is free, that the dual controls have to be mounted and all that stuff so you're really you can plan your trainings and this facility uh, makes life for the crew trainer much easier. So on the beginning, uh, like all the time, when you bring in something new, pilots are a little bit skeptical. So was that the case here when we uh, brought in uh, this uh, simulator. And once the pilot, they have realized that uh, this tool is a big benefit, it's uh, clear that Every pilot, uh, every six months, wants to go on the simulator because he knows he can do much more things uh, inside on the simulator than uh, outside on the real helicopter. And we had uh, several pilots coming from all over the world and some even experienced back home emergency procedures, so they gave the feedback that they were super happy that they had this training just earlier. They were telling us that training uh, value is really high and this is how we want to share our experiences and uh, bring more safety in the, this industry.